year, new me, starting off with a yoga retreat. No, wait, yoga retreat was Saturday. Today is... Rise and shine, ladies! Emergency fund boot camp. Let's get those money muscles moving! Huh? Huh? Uh, huh? Excuse huh? me. That's major savings to you, recruit. Okay, huh? Major, huh? I think there's huh? been a mistake. Huh? I'm not huh? supposed to be huh? in this class. Huh? I don't even need huh? an emergency fund. What did you say? Um, I've never been fired and I almost never get sick, so I don't think I need an emergency fund. Treadmill, go! You might think you're marching along just fine without an emergency fund. But what happens when you lose your job? Or get into an accident that wrecks your car? Or get hit with an unexpected medical bill, huh? I know those examples get tossed around a lot, but I really just can't see that stuff happening to me. Plus, I have insurance for that kind of stuff. Thank you very much. Oh yeah? You think you're invincible, recruit? What if a family member gets ill and you have to look after them? Or your insurance reimbursement takes longer than expected? What if your pet needs a crazy operation in order to live? What if your hot water tank explodes? Or there's a flash flood? Or your refrigerator catches fire? With no emergency fund, you just wouldn't be able to keep up. Here. And just how am I supposed to deal with a bunch of giant, unpredictable expenses all on my own? Well, recruit, a healthy emergency fund will spot you for the truly unpredictable obstacles. But you can lighten the load by saving for some expenses before they turn into emergencies. How can I save for something I don't know will happen? You may not know the when, but you know the what if you own a vehicle. Start saving for eventual repairs. If you own a pet... I have a cat. Then start saving for eventual cat repairs. Or whatever cats need. The point is, the more you budget for outside of your emergency fund, the better you'll be able to manage whatever comes at you. Now drop down and give me a thousand. A thousand? You heard me, one thousand. Dollars, that is. Makes for a good starting goal for your emergency fund. Over time, you should increase that to six months' worth of expenses. It takes time and dedication to get there, but once you make it, what in the... Just because something's unexpected doesn't mean you can't be prepared for it. I'm proud of you, recruit. So proud. I don't know, but you've been told your spending and savings must be controlled. You've given me some good advice. A slice of pizza would be nice. Sound off. Pizza. Sound off. Pizza. No more workouts only. Pizza. Hey.